does not have to be financial alone. Yes. Your relationships can also be part of your startup capital. Exactly. When you want to set up a business. Yes. Uh, social capital. Some have called it social capital. Intellectual capital is another. Uh, you didn't have intellectual capital initially. Instead of you getting someone to come and train you, you didn't have the money to pay the person. Instead of you getting a consultant who already had the intellectual capital to come and execute the idea for you, you didn't have the money. Yeah. So you just went out there to get intellectual capital yourself. So here again, you're leveraging on relationship. So your first marketing were conducted on digital media, in exactly. the digital space. Yes. And to hasten it, you leveraged on existing influencers. Exactly. All this genius thinking, where did you get it from? You didn't study business management. You are engineers. You studied computer science. Well, at some point when I was in my final year, I said probably I should have just studied management. Uh, probably. Yeah, so you got that business. I've got a business idea right from time. So you probably learned it from the street or maybe it's genetic or something. Would I say street? Probably from movies. From movies. Yes. Wow. Besides digital marketing, and I like the idea that you used influencers. A lot of people don't recognize that. Um, many of our people tend to just bust onto social media and start advertising by themselves. And I do tell them that, look, yes, you can do this by yourself, but you are limited. But you can pull votes your way to success by looking for existing giants and just stand on their shoulders. Exactly. And voila, you're, you're standing tall. And I like the fact that you guys were not, were not shy to come out and say, look, let's go and look for some giants in the digital media space and leverage on their existing platforms. Besides that, what other things did you do? Or oh, that was just sufficient for you? It actually, um, it, we had to think of um, <clears throat> our targets, like uh, the, the market. Mm -hmm. we the target were. market. So we knew uh, it would be mostly um, students mm. or youth um, working already. So and if we feel all these people are glued to their phones. And yeah. They, they, they are either, constantly they are either, online. They are either oh, using Twitter. Facebook or Twitter, or on this day, are on one of them using it constantly. They are constantly online. So we don't really have to walk up to people and start sharing flyers. Mm -hmm.